Okay, so ladies, I want to do something a little bit different. I actually wanted to do this about a month ago. And for some reason, it just was not happening. I did it on YouTube, didn't, didn't happen, tried to do it on here, didn't record. So I am back to give you... This is what I came to talk to y'all about, your sweet thing, okay? If you have a husband, you have a spouse, you have a committed partner, I want to come in and talk to you guys about how you need to be more supportive towards your husband. The first thing I want you to do is hear them out. The last thing somebody wants you to do, especially a man, is for you to down talk the idea that he has. So do me a favor and do yourself a favor and hear him out. Actually hear his idea, okay? You want to be as supportive as possible when it comes down to a business idea because it takes a lot for anyone to tell you about their business idea, let alone a man who believes that you're going to critique exactly what he is trying to do, okay? The second thing I want you to do is show that you understand where the business is going to go and you understand that he wants your buy-in, wants your investment. So do something like gift, right? Gift him. Gift him something that lets him know that, hey, I see what you're doing. So this could literally be, depending on what type of business it is, this could be you gifting a business card. This could be you um, gifting an item that you know he will use for the business because when people see that you're investing in them and their business, they more so understand that you believe in them. It's not about the thing you buy, it's about the fact that you're listening and you're believing in their idea, okay? The next thing I need you to do, this is a big one, and I even had to work on it for a very long time, is fix your face, okay? When <laughs> your man tells you about a business, of course, side note is, if you are in a long-term relationship or a marriage, you probably counsel, right? You probably are an advisor to him. You're the person that he bends your ear, right? You're his you're his you're his hearing ear. So, he's going to want to share with you his business ideas and what he wants to do and some of the things may may sound far-fetched. He might tell you something like, I want to get a $10,000 loan out. He might tell you, hey, I want to move to this next city over and I want you to fix your face. Because for many of us who've been with people for a long time, people that you're with can read your face, okay? And many of us ladies, we wear our, we wear our, emotions on our face so if we're mad you can see it in our face if we're happy you can see it in our face if we're questioning you can see it in our face so i need you to do me a favor when your husband when your your spouse when your boo your bae comes to you with an idea make sure you're watching your face because your face can tell it all and again the last thing he needs is to come home tell his wife or spouse about his brand new idea and he can read it on your face that you don't believe a damn thing he's saying, okay? I need you not to do that. Baby girl, fix your face, okay? The next thing I'm gonna need you to do, give it time, okay? You and I both know nothing was built in a day. You have to give him time to find actual steps, ways, procedures of how he's gonna go about it. So yes, I know you. he told you a year ago that he was gonna start this business, but a year ago he may not have had the information he needed. A year ago he may not have been as informed as he should have been, or he may not have had the money that he needed to have, or the time, or whatever. But I need you, as a supportive spouse, to please give the man some time. Give him time, boo. He gonna do it. Now, granted, I'm talking to you, Mano y mano, uno y uno, okay? Woman to woman, trust me. Trust me. I know the pain when he's come home and he got this big idea and you like, okay, I'm, I'm a roll with you, babe, but it's gonna take some time, especially great things take time. You guys, you know this. Great things take time. So he may not get to the idea that he told you about two years ago as fast as he may want to or as fast as you may want him to but you've got to keep it in mind that great things take time okay so i need you to continue to stand on the sidelines and be the cheerleader 
Now, we're going to move on into being a support system. This is not you jumping in and doing everything for him. This is not you jumping in and trying to make stuff happen on his behalf. This is you literally being a support, not a critic. Okay? So if he's going to tell you, babe, I'm trying to get this contract and, you know, I don't know what to say to these people. That might be where you come in and you say, well, babe, I know how to, you know, put some words together, put some letters together. I'll do it. I'll do that for you. Okay. This is not you coming in to take over because for many, not all. Okay. But let me just say for some, some women have takeover spirits and, and that's good in some instances, but with this right here, that is wrong. Do not do that. Okay, boo. You cannot have a takeover spirit when this is his business and this is his thing. And for some of you guys who may not know, okay, your success may be on the other side of your spouse's success. So it's in your best interest to be as supportive as possible because if you guys are in a serious relationship, long-term relationship, a marriage, if he gonna blow up, you're going to blow up right along with them. So I need you to be supportive and be that cheerleader on the sideline, keyword sideline, and don't, <laughs> don't be trying to get on the field and play the game because that's not what you're there to do. You're there to be a support system. So if he needs you to do something and he asks you to or you see fit to, do it. But do not go taking over this man's dream, taking over this man's idea, definitely not telling them what he needs to do because Men take more pride in the things that they do than the things that they were helped to do, okay? So I need you to, let's wrap it up, okay? I need you to be more open to supporting your man, encouraging your man in his business by hearing him out, gifting him for his business, watching your facial, you know, your facial, okay? I need you to give it time and I need you to be as supportive as you can be from the sideline so that he can go ahead and make his dream come true. You won't be forgotten, okay? You won't be left at the wayside. You'll be somebody that will be right next to him when everything is blowing up and becoming as successful as you know it will be because you believe in him and you believe in the things that he has shared with you. Okay, so you guys, I hope this was helpful. I just want to bring this to you guys, just a little something, something, you know, nothing too major. So for those of you who do not know, make sure you guys are joining the Pretty Money Gang, the Facebook group. Uh, also, make sure you guys are tuning into the YouTube channel, Pretty Chicks Invest, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye, y'all.